What's up Mopar fam? Hope everybody's having a blessed day out there. As you can see, we have a new huge project here. My God, what are you fixing to do? Trans brake launch it? No! <laughs> broke down I sold my old open trailer that we've been using for frostbite and uh, actually made pretty good money on that trailer by selling it and we bought a used enclosed trailer um, for actually less money than I was able to sell my trailer for so it worked out pretty good so we have a little bit extra cash to put into this um, enclosed trailer that we just picked up that we are going to turn into our race trailer for frostbite and the track when we go racing so let's check this thing out so obviously it was already somebody else's trailer so we got to take off some decals we got to do some work um, we're about to get new tires and wheels for it this is a pace uh, 26 foot trailer so it's a little bit longer than what we had before it had a winch already a battery uh, it's got lighting in it nothing fancy it's got one down there also um, but we're going to be putting some LEDs in here and we are about to um, paint, me and the kids, we're going to paint all of the walls and the ceiling white. That way um, when the lights are on it's going to be pretty bright in here. Um, should brighten it up tremendously. Uh, we've already ripped out the old flooring. Um, it had this checkered uh, like race flooring tile stuff on it as you can see it was pretty well shot it had some holes in it everywhere um, so we ripped that out and we are going to redo the ramp and the whole floor with some garage floor epoxy coating um, is what I decided to do I think it's gonna be the best bang for the buck and look pretty good when we get done and uh, yeah be a fun little project and uh, it's gonna be nice and cozy in here to get frostbite in that's for sure so I haven't quite figured out exactly how we're gonna do all that yet um, I'm not the skinniest slash jockey kind of guy so we're probably gonna to have to dupes a hazard it through the driver window to get in and out or we're gonna to have to use the winch um, a lot of people just use a winch to pull in their car and uh, whatnot so we may do that um, I haven't really made my mind up yet, but this is what we're doing. Um, for the track events that we've been going to, I just kind of really wanted to do an enclosed trailer. Um, that way, if it's raining, you know, we have some shelter to get to besides just sitting under a tent. Normally, when we go, we kind of have like pop up tents up and we're kind of camping out, you know, right there. This is going to be nice um, to have because we'll be able to build. You know, kind of like a cool little hang. Um, once we get it all painted and done, I'm going to put uh, like a workbench across here, some upper cabinets maybe. Um, I've already got a portable AC unit we're going to install over here in this corner. Um, so we're going to have AC in here as well. Install stereo setup where we got some surround, we got some speakers, something to listen to. Um, and then I also want to get a awning um, to mount to the side of the trailer uh, we're gonna get a pretty big awning that we can fold down and uh, be able to have an awning outside as well so yeah it's gonna be quite a bit of work but overall um, this older trailer is in really good shape still um, previous owner really could, took care of it um, besides the tires are rotten uh, but they're holding air but all in all it's a solid trailer it's in good condition still all the wood is solid and uh, I feel pretty good about it. We ended up getting this thing for 7500 bucks. Um, I feel like that's a pretty good deal. And uh, 
yeah and it came with the winch already and a battery so pretty stoked so that's it guys that's what we've been up to um stay tuned i'll probably do some follow-up videos on how this trailer transforms over time and uh be pretty cool so stay tuned we'll see you on the next one don't forget hit that subscribe button comment give the video a thumbs up we'll see you soon dylan derby out of winder georgia and josie roush roush in the slightly pink influenced 2019 model challenger out of Livonia, Michigan. Both of them off and away. Derby out in front of the pickup truck right hand side. And Derby goes 1098 at 123. Roush goes 1304 at 107.